What's going on, YouTube? You already know who it is. It's your boy, Deco Two Times, back again with another banger. Right now, I want to talk about this Tessa Blanchard topic and everybody that's making their videos and basically talking about this. So it's now it's my turn to talk about it. And I'm just going to come out and say it, man. People are saying Tessa Blanchard is a racist. They're saying that she's bullying people, etc. And... I'm going to address all this because right now I'm I'm digging into this and I'm seeing a lot of hypocrisy right here, you know, and we're just going to get right into it, man, with this Chelsea Green shit, right? You, some of y'all may know Chelsea Green, but for the ones who don't know, um, she used to work for Impact Wrestling. Um, you probably saw her debut on Monday Night Raw. You probably saw her and made her debut last week at NXT. And Chelsea Green, I'm going to call you out. I don't believe your story. I really don't, Chelsea Green. And the reason why I don't believe your story is because you worked with Tessa Blanchard at All In at that um, gay EW event or AEW. And you was holding her hand. You was holding her hand in the air. So I can't trust you. I can't believe your word. I'm sorry. Because if you knew she bullied you. You knew that she did all of these things, belittling people, putting people down. Then why are you in a picture with her with raising her hand? So your your claims and shit, they're dismissed. I don't believe you. You're doing that because you saw Allison K, better known as Sienna from NWA, come out and, and said her little piece. But as far as you go, I don't believe you. You're doing that for attention, and you're definitely doing that for clout. Now, to the um, Allison Cade um, accusations and her her tweet basically saying that Tessa Blanchard spat in a black person's face and called her the N word, and the victim came out and confirmed that yes, what Allison K said is true. Now, this is where Tessa Blanchard kind of looks iffy because Tessa Blanchard will call out. The um, hypocrisy of Chelsea Green, as she should, and told her, you know my number, hit me up. Now, why didn't Tessa Blanchard address the Allison Cade situation? Nobody's not asking these type of questions besides me because I'm the first of my kind and the last of my kind. Why didn't Tessa Blanchard sit here and basically address what Allison Cade said? She just totally ignored Allison K. Now, as of this recording, Tessa Blanchard has lost a booking and is with Heavy Metal Wrestling. They, on their event, um, January the 24th, 2020, they said that they removed her and they're basically giving refunds if anybody who bought a ticket to watch their program or go to their event they can get their money back because Tessa Blanchard is no longer a part of it. Now, as far as Chelsea Green go, forget Chelsea Green. All right? Chelsea Green, you're, you're just doing this because you want attention. You worked with Tessa Blanchard, okay? You worked with this girl and everything else. So I don't believe you. So your uh, accusations are just, you know, you're full of shit. But I really wanted her to address, uh, who do I want her to address? I really wanted her to address Allison K in the um, victim. Because the victim came out and said, yeah, she said this. Yeah, she spat in my face. I wanted her to address that because these are serious allegations of racism and bullying. Now, as far as Chelsea Green goes, Chelsea Green can just eat a dick, Okay. She's sexy as hell, don't get me wrong. I want her to eat my dick and I'll fuck her in her mouth. But, you know, that doesn't mean anything right now because at this current situation, this is kind of looking kind of kind of odd and kind of funny. So, other than that, man, Tessa Blanchard has currently lost one show because of these accusations that's coming her way. Um... At the end of the day, everybody is talking about this. Um, basically, it got the uh, internet, at least the wrestling internet world talking over this topic. And I'm just going to be real with it. So, 
Chelsea Green, your um, claims and everything like that, they're dismissed. I don't believe you, okay? I don't fucking believe you. You're full of shit. Now, as far as Allison Cade and the victim's concerns, I want Tessa Blanchard to address that. But she says in a tweet that she's not going to address it. It's silly. She's not going to put no shine or light on it. But you should. Because the victim, the alleged victim came out and said that, yes, this is confirmed. You're losing, you're losing bookings. You know, you should come out and you should address this. Don't run from it. Address the Sienna, a.k.a. Allison Kate accusations. And the victim, address this. You shouldn't run from that as far as you replying to Chelsea Green. Yeah, she was doing that for clout. She sure was. Because... She was in the same picture with you in celebrating your 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 um, fruits of your labor and everything else. So Chelsea Green's accusations are thrown out the window. The real the real accusations is coming from Sienna and the alleged victim. You should address this because if you don't, then this could basically affect your history, hurt your legacy, hurt everything that you're building. So you debunk the Chelsea Green shit with no problems, but you ignore the Sienna accusations. You ignore the um, the victims' accusations, basically saying it's true. And on top of that, you can never go back to stardom because of this. So all I'm saying is you should have addressed that. You should have ignored Chelsea Green. You should have basically ignored her because she full of shit. At the end of the day, that's the thing that I want her to address. I don't care about Chelsea Green. I could care less about Chelsea Green at this point because she's doing this because she saw Sienna doing it. And it basically got Sienna retweets and likes and shit like that. So, of course, she wanted attention for herself. At the end of the day, the real, the real situation is that you should have addressed Sienna. You should have addressed the fact that she said this, because basically she the one that put the fucking lighter and the gas to light this up. OK, so at the end of the day, that's all I'm going to say about this situation, man. Uh, on that note, be sure to uh, hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Um, all my social media links are in the description below. Be sure to run those numbers up. And yeah, man. That's all I can say about this situation because right now it, it's not looking too good. You know, the fact that Sienna has basically said that you did these things and you totally ignored it and didn't give two fucks about it. But you address Chelsea Green, uh, a person who's basically lied about her situation because, oh, man, you know what? You just got to address this. I'm sorry. You know, right now it, it's 50 50. Because I kind of believe Sienna because she's, she wouldn't do something like this for attention. And I kind of don't believe it because I want to believe in my heart that you would never do something like this. Because the simple fact that you hung around Cedric Alexander. You hung around um, his girlfriend or his wife. And they're African American. I don't want to believe that you're this person who would do that because... At the same time, you trained with Cedric, okay? So I don't want to believe it. But then again, it's like, why would Sienna lie about this? I'm torn. So I'm not picking no sides. At the end of the day, the truth will come out, you know? I'm not going to sit there and pick a side. Then when it comes back, I'm looking crazy. I'm not going to do that. At the end of the day, you need to address the Sienna accusations. And that's all I can say. The hell with Chelsea Green because it just proves that Chelsea Green just wanted to join the little uh, bad wagon that Sienna got. So at the end of the day, you need to address that. I know you probably will never see this video and that's cool. But for my two cents alone, you need to address that. You need to clear your name because it's not looking good. It's causing you It's causing you bookings. And when you, and when you get... To that point where it's causing you bookings, you're losing money. 
So you need to address that. That's all I'm going to say. Other than that, man, it's your boy Deku two times. I'm signing out, man. Peace.